the aims of street bikes is to change people's lives through cycling. And I realise there's a big gap in the market in cycling for the people who can't ride a bike and the women who won't go on men's bike riding. And it started from there, really. Street Bikes gets the bikes from the local tips where we've got an SLA with all the four tips in Kirklees and we get them from local residents who randomly ring us up using through the website, Twitter and Facebook. We take the bikes into the seven garages we've got all over Kirklees and then we bring them to this recycling point at Lockwood and we have two trained mechanics and four assistant mechanics who put them back together, make them roadworthy and then I give them away to worthy recipients. We work in deprived communities where children have nothing and we give them bikes, change their lives, make them realise there's aspirations out of their area. We work, um, we do proper cycle coaching for main events where we're doing a cyclocross event next week in half term with the kids from Corn Valley. We work with people with disabilities who come and use all our adaptive bikes at spend five times a week. We work with women only and uh, give them confidence to ride the bike, but it not only gives them confidence to ride the bike, it gives them confidence in every other part of their life. We've got lots more people riding bikes to work. We give people who've just got a job, maybe the bus service and local transport isn't good enough for the time they start work, and then now we are giving them bikes and they're using them to go to university, they're using them to go to schools. Um, we've got thousands of young people in our database. Um, we, work, we actually deliver bike mechanic training to AQA standard, which is on the GCSE scale. We, we go out and we give them a bike and we change behaviour. We give them responsibility in our bike rides. We've done cycle and healthy eating projects, as in Chickenley. We've taken the kids off Chickenley. They cycle to Cleck Eat and Tesco's. They've all had a responsibility in Tesco's to get part of the meal and we've cycled back and cooked that meal together. We're reducing CO2 by people not using the cars and using the bikes. Um, we're getting people fitter by um, changing the environment and it's just spreading. The more people we're giving a bike to, it's become like an explosion. Um, we gave away 900 bikes in the last 12 months. Okay. We are sustainable because we use our initiative to look for stuff. It's not about money, it's about things like this van was donated by Metro, the signage was donated by uh, 117, a local company. And that's the thing that I'm trying to do, I'm, I'm targeting companies who work in Kirklees who are interested in what we do. I get quite a lot of support from Kirklees Council. Um, I, I get funding from all different pots, wh whether it be from like community workers, or we've just got a two year contract to run the mixed ability through community partnerships. But I also work in partnership with lots of the agencies of the council and that's why it works. I think from our point of view, social enterprises work because they work with other people. You don't work in a silo on your own. You, you work in partnership with anybody that you can think of. My message to people who want to set up a social enterprise is have the passion, have the commitment and have a great idea. Go knocking on doors, don't wait for people to come to you, go out there and make it work.